recovery walk for Cheshire. This walk is part of Recovery Month, a UK-wide celebration of recovery taking place throughout September. This afternoon now we've got recovery bands, we've got stuff going on in the park here and you don't really need to hear me any more than that other than thank you very much for coming today. Thank you very much, cheers. set up everything and then we went into Chester um, and it was, it's just been good, it's been a great day out for us all. We've been playing the music, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, did you go on? Yeah it's good, no, it's a, it's a, when we came last year, um, same thing last year, great, it's good, it's a good thing isn't it, for everyone to get together, so done the walk and that and set all our gear up and now we're done. Playing. I love playing in front of people in, in recovery and having a chance. Yeah, it was great. It's always a pleasure to see yourself. I've had a top day me. I, I was one of the um, founder members of the CRF but, but on the walk last year. Again, it's like me, you, Dominic, different event, like different me. place, but we're, we're still here and, and I think it's just testimony to... And that's the pinch um, of Jaffa cake here. Mm. Testimony why we're, we're, we're still here because we do this oh, stuff like this, we come and do visible recovery and we support everyone. Oh, I've never even tried. Well. <laughs> yeah, we've, uh, we've been here with uh, Turning Point uh, to uh, hand out flyers and information on the drugs and alcohol in the area, Chester. Uh, it's been good, yeah, we went on the war, it was all positive. Actually brilliant. Yeah, it's good to go on the war because uh, just to uh, promote recovery and awareness and just be inspired and uninspired, you know, and um, like promote change, encourage people to consider change. You know. It's really, really good day, really good day. 
everybody comes together because they genuinely want to help people and you know sp spreading a positive message about recovery is real and and it's powerful and and you can impact on somebody else's life and it is transforming it's really amazing yeah um, we're going to be performing with Portal Angels Dance Theatre. Yeah. Um, it's the first time we've performed. Yeah. It's all for people in recovery. Um, we're Dance looking for new members! members. Salford Fallen Angels and the reason I came here today because obviously I want to show that recovery is visible and also to support my Cheshire Fallen Angels. I first saw Fallen Angels um, when I was actually still in addiction um, over five years ago and it was when I watched the awakening at the Lowry Centre in Salford and it was just something about it I just fell in love with the actual dancing I mean I like dancing anyway and I like music because music helps me with my therapy with my depression and stuff um, and then Fallen Angels came to Salford and as soon as they said Fallen Angels was coming to Salford I thought, right, that's it, I'm joining. Because um, I, I, I suffer a lot with my depression. Um, my addiction's been arrested um, now because I'm, I'm like nearly four years into my recovery. Um, but like I say, dancing helps me express how I feel with my depression and, and it, boosts, it boosts me up with my depression. Um, so I started going to Salford Fallen Angels and one particular evening I couldn't have anybody to look after Letitia and um, I asked the group if Letitia could come and they said, are you okay with Letitia, you know, hearing about recovery and addiction? I went, yeah, I'm fine with it because I'm quite open with my daughter about it. So she came one night and she was there by accident, like I say, and she ended up joining in. And um, since then we've been dancing together and it actually inspires me more because, because she enjoys doing it more as well. When I'm, I am having a bad day with depression, she will say to me, come on mum, it's Tuesday, we need to go to dance. can inspire one person and say to somebody who is struggling to get into recovery, who's finding it hard, reach out, reach out, it's the best thing I did nearly four years ago, because if I hadn't have done, I'd be dead. Yeah, I enjoy it, and it's brought me close to my mum, we found something we both like doing, and it's keeping my mum healthy. I did my best to notice when the call came down the line Until the platform of surrender I was brought but I was kind And sometimes I get nervous When I see an open door